Everybody close your doors. Make sure your mom's not looking. We're watching stream. <laughs> Comparing two completely unrelated things. What are you talking about over there? Is Curly W getting old and crotchety in the chat? All right. I think this is an interesting match. You know, many people talk about how good... Yeah, I'm a big JB fan, if you guys don't know. I'm a hell of a big JB fan. Uh, many people talk about how good Balrog is as a character. But I think that he gets smoked by Rashid. I think this matchup is really bad. Um, I also think that Rashid is one of the best characters in the game. I think he's top two. He's super strong. Because the difference between him and Ibuki is probably this. That I think that... Um, Rashid is a little bit more controlling, right? He's a little bit better at handling the ground and sort of preventing wackiness. And, um, he sort of shuts you down a lot easier. But, uh, you know, Ibuki has better, like, mix-up potential and one chance. So, it's like an interesting scenario. His neutral is much stronger than Ibuki's, I think. But her set play and just general, like, kind of way to snowball the match is just crazy. So, yeah, it's interesting. Anyway, let's check this out. This matchup is hard, man. It's tough to deal with all this because, look, he's cornered, right? I mean, he could have interrupted both of those tornadoes with V-Skill, maybe. But, like, yeah, it's what do you do? You're already cornered. You're already in range of crouching fierce. Like, what are you going to do, right? Sweep. It's a knockdown. Baits the throw. And it's just, it snowballs really fast. This is a, this is a tough matchup for sure. Crushed him. He's stunned. I like that setup a lot from JB. He does that quite a bit. Four dash, back dash. Yeah, he likes that one too. I've seen this guy play a few times. So this this setup that he does here is really interesting. So it's jump short, uh, jump jab. He does jump jab or jump short, and both of them have very light blocks done so that the fierce actually, I believe, it crush counters throw here, right? That's what I. That's what it looks like to me. Oh no, light kick. He does standing light kick. Boom, right? It's light blocks done, so it actually catches him. Which Invitational, if there's footage of it? Did you miss the MVCI analysis? Yeah, we just watched a couple of matches. Back throw. One more back throw kill. A lot of bar, too. JB is really funny if you talk to him in person. I, I think he's he's very funny to talk to. He told me that he doesn't drink a lot of soda anymore because he doesn't want to get the punk belly. And I said, the punk belly? He's like, yeah, have you seen it? The punk belly? <laughs> Oh, he missed his throw loop. Wow, he just went for that kind of stuff, and I just had to win out of my way to thank Lionhearted Boy for subscribing for $4.99. That's very kind of you. I'm sure he subscribed because he saw this really funky scenario. So, if you guys don't know this about Rashid's throw loop, right? If you guys don't know this about Rashid's throw loop, uh, JB was talking about this. You can't dash and then throw a three-frame character. And I had the three-frame reaction, so thank Pings999 for the Twitch Prime. Thanks very much for your subscription. You don't actually get a real throw loop as Rashid if you dash here. You have to walk forward and manually time it against the three-frame button. So there is room for error, right? And then he backdashes, and this man just spins, because he knows that there's no way you backdash on wake up and do nothing. Damn, you hit me with the subscription and then the follow? That's very, very nice of you. He went overhead, but the V-reversal got him out of there. Man, what was Curly W talking about? I'm curious. Oh, baits a throw. That's why his jump fierce, I think, is one of the best jump normals in the game. It's tough to anti-air, and it hits on the way down. No V-trigger. Oh, he tried to dash up and block it. Smoked. This matchup is tough, man. You really just have to hope. You have to wish for the best with Balrog. Taiwan Cup in this week. Isn't it next weekend? You haven't typed anything for like five minutes? Yeah, what were you talking about before? The comparison. You just disappeared on me. Yeah, if you know him, used to be a wrestler, I think. He used to do grappling of some kind. I used to be a wrestler too, so I was talking about it. He used to do some kind of grappling. I don't remember what it was. Damn, he's actually hitting a button. Oh, man, you see the low profile on that? You see the low profile on Rashid's crouching medium kick? This is one of the lowest buttons in the game. It's one of the absolute lowest buttons in the game. Even though Smug is plus after dash punch. You see this? Smug is plus one, so he tries to do standing jab. And Rashid's crouching medium kick goes clean under. See that? 
It just goes clean under. A buddy of yours tells you that all fighting games are the same. Just show him a couple of different fighting games. It'll probably clear him up. Oh, wow. That actually anti -aired? That was a good pickup. V skill is dead. That's like the first time he reacted with V skill, right? V skill through the fireball. Whoops. I turned down Jimmy and Davy G. All fighting games are just functions. You know, I'm somebody who picks their characters for the function, kind of. So I could sort of agree with that sentiment. I I want a character who's cool and fits the function I want. He's trying to bait V reversal there. That low medium kick, man. Crushed him. Whoa, that buffer. That's pretty good. That was a pretty tight buffer. He just does crouching fierce and knows it's likely Smug's gonna hit a button after. Yeah, that double jeopardy should not have happened, right? Smash GG has errors with their bracketing, correct? When I saw that Brian had lost to Alex Myers twice, I was like, that shouldn't happen that early in the bracket. It's an error on Smash GG size side, correct? I don't think that's supposed to happen. It's dumping the players into the wrong positions. That doesn't avoid double jeopardy because they should be swapped. Yeah. There was like some kind of error. It's a bug. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. J B. Yeah, I don't know why it keeps happening, but it seems like it. There, there seems to consistently be an error, and Hodger Beats uh, is consistently in the chat, and now subscribe with Twitch Prime. Thanks very much. Hey, did you miss your resub? I don't think that's your first sub, is it? Oh, this is a smug game for sure. Don't mess this up. There it is. Nice and clean. So that's pretty much the only way I think Balrog wins his matchup. I think that he gets smoked on the ground. He gets cornered easily. He uh, he just gets dunked in a lot of the spaces on screen. The only time that he doesn't get dunked is if he is doing the dunking. He has to keep up offense because if you lose offense, Rashid kind of smokes you. It's honestly like you just yeah you just eat stuff like this all day. When he couldn't even V skill through the projectile lasted too long. You guys see that? You see, he tried to he tried to use his projectile invincibility, but the fireball lingered. It lingers for too long, right? He V skills, but he just gets clipped. Wow, four dash back dash to be throw. And also, the thing about this matchup is that because he's V reversaling so consistently to get out of crouching fierce. First of all, when you V reversal it, you don't really gain much. But second of all, you you will lose your V-trigger. Yeah, see, he, he V-reversals, and then, like, what does he get here, right? Nothing. Just clean whiff punish. So he lost his V-trigger, and he didn't gain anything from it. Again, low profile. I think Smug has to hit standing light kick. Low profile. It just goes right under it, right? See? It's just so low to the ground. This man is as low as it goes. Yeah, I saw Rick tweet about it. Damn, he EX mixer did? Jesus. JB is really good at this matchup. See that? Even though he tried to V-scale through it, it lingers so long that you just can't get through it. It's just out there for forever. Maybe if he did it slightly later, but look, it just takes forever. The projectile is still there, and he pushes you forward back into it. Oh, my God. 
There's also something weird about the seating. I feel like many players run into each other in the same point in the brackets over and over. Got him. He gets a combo off that. Yeah, counter hit medium punch and EX uh, will combo. Not regular medium punch. Throw loop? Yes, that'll kill. That's a legit throw loop against three frame characters, the walk up. This right here. Did he actually hit a button? I didn't see. No, it doesn't look like it. He just stood up. Oh, no, he tapped? I don't know. What was that? Is that just his get up animation? That's so weird. Huh. Yeah, that's a real throw loop in the corner. It's just you have to manually time it. Give me Maki and Ingrid? All right, relax over there. Well, I think he could have trade comboed off that. Damn, that's big damage. I'm impressed that he actually saw that his move connected. Uh-oh. Good block. Stun? Yeah. It's strange to me, too. Everybody uses Smash GG, but it has issues with that format. So double jeopardy happens so often. Uh, if you remove, to remove throw loops from the game, especially in the corner, that's why most characters have them in the corner, because you're so close. To remove throw loops from the game would be very difficult. You'd have to make it so that throws could be back rolled, and you'd have to take a lot of, yeah, actually, I guess you can make throws just back roll, allowed to be back rolled. But even then, like, I don't know, it's some of the only guaranteed offense out there. Am I going to Evo Japan? Yeah, that's the plan. Can you post the link in here? What do you have? that trade there i think he's zero right so he must have hit standing jab or maybe they both hit three frame damn he did it from hella far are you serious add wake up throw invincibility i guess yeah yeah you can link it no combo stun where's the con what are you doing jb oh, all right i guess he got him he got him. i remember when this happened i was really surprised he missed like four things in a row I'm going to actually look at that bracket in a second because I want to look at the same thing. That shouldn't be happening. That's a Smash GG error. Because I remember when Brian F. was telling me he lost the Myers right out of pools. I was like, that's not how that should work. Because he lost the Myers in pools and then had to play him like immediately again. You see how, man, JB escaped the corner by not doing anything. Did you guys see that? JB escaped the corner by not doing anything. So he jumps here. This is a threat to do wall jump either out or down. Right? You can go in either direction. But he does nothing. And that forces Smug to jump because he thinks that JB is going to wall jump. So this gives JB a free anti-air and a roll out of the corner. So to get out of the corner, JB did actually nothing. Again, same thing. Fake wall escape. <laughs> that was scary. He's got CA to chip now. This is where you're pretty much done. I think Smug here could have just got wake up CA and chipped. But that's why he backdashes to try to bait it. And then he has an even better choice. Because once he creates space here to activate, it's over. When you do the roll through the tornado, look at how fast you are. Boom. And that's chip. Right? As soon as you roll... As soon as you roll here, you gain so much speed because anything that moves forward gets uh, enhanced by this tornado. So JB did the smartest possible thing he could, which is just block it out, take the guaranteed chip. Right, this whole series here, he did it. It was really smart of him to just wait, because now that he has full bar, it's over. I mean, making it so throws are back rollable would out fix throw loops. Also, got him. Because throws can only be quick rise or late rise, so you only have to time the throw for meaty quick rise and then have a secondary setup for back roll. 
or for a late rise. But if there is back throw roll available, that would help. It would also make media so much worse. <laughs>